It turns out that this answer would be negative 6. Let's see why. You might have thought to multiply these together to get the square root of positive 36, which equals 6. But we know that's not true since 6 is a real number and these two are imaginary numbers. The product rule does not hold for imaginary numbers. It only holds for real numbers. This was our product rule, and before, x and y had to be greater than 0. That was so that way these radicals were real numbers, rather than imaginary numbers. Instead of multiplying these radicands together, let's simplify each one by using our imaginary number, i. So we'll have 2i here, and 3i for here. Multiplying will get 6i squared. We can replace this i squared with its corresponding value, negative 1. We substitute that in to get 6 times negative 1, which equals negative 6, our answer.